Today we're checking out the USS, the Ultra Safe Sponge, designed for rinseless washing or traditional bucket washing. Can go between both. Extremely soft, TRC tested, and proven. It's the latest in uh, sponge technology from the Rag Company. We're going to compare it to the ever impressive Ultra black sponge head to head see which one comes out on top because a lot of people want to see them compared side by side and see what all the fuss is about and see which one you should pick up for yourself and today we're using them both with a rinseless wash brand new to the market armor detail supplies hero it's actually dropping on the 25th we're going to test it out today see if you should check this out along with whichever sponge comes out on top let's check it out in today's video so hero rinseless wash has been a, a project between eddie cologne and armor detail supply they've joined together to create this Hero Rinseless Wash. I know it is a uh, polymer style. So we're gonna dilute it 256 to one in the bucket. It smells like strawberry kiwi, very good scent. As you can see, it's kind of pinkish, purplish in color. We're gonna put it in there. We got an ultra safe sponge already in the bucket. Give it a stir. You can see not much foam, that kind of deal. So they did a good job controlling the surfactants in the mix along with the polymers. And the back says, Hero is a hybrid solution, synergizing active lubricating polymers with specialized residue free surfactant chemistries to effortlessly dissolve dirt, grime, all that good stuff. And incorporates a SiO2 backbone, which increases the slickness in the product. So Hero hybrid rinseless wash will be our rinseless wash today. We got it also inside the keg at the same dilution. This is, a, one, of, this is one of them Scott Grave Facebook specials. Hit him up, he makes kegs. And uh, they're really, really good. But today, the main topic of the video is the Ultra Safe Sponge versus the Ultra Black Sponge. And this is a seasoned Ultra Black Sponge. I've been using it for quite a while. I did let it dry. So we can do some comparisons here right out the box. So let's crack the USS open. I have been using the Ultra Safe Sponge, this one in the bucket. Used it a couple times already. Used it at TRCMA. And uh, I do like both sponges. I am a fan of both sponges. And so far, so good in the short-term testing. But let's get to the nitty-gritty. As you can see, both are virtually identical in a size, cut, and comparison. The same kind of shape, but much different foam. So you can see right here, if we put them together, give them a little squeeze test. The Ultra Safe Sponge definitely is the squishier of the two, and it's kind of really well seasoned right out the package. So it's gonna be the more seasoned, ready to go sponge. And not saying the Ultra Black isn't ready to go, it is ready to go too, because once you put it in the bucket, like so, you get it well saturated, you give it a couple of good squeezes, especially after like this one has been uh, used for quite a while, it gets nice and pliable and soft as well. And here's a wet ultra safe sponge. It is super squishy when it's got that rinseless wash. Really, really feels nice in the hands. So both sponges fully saturated. You got the ultra safe, got the ultra black. You can see really squishy the USS gets when it's uh, fully saturated. The cuts in the sponge also seem virtually identical. If anybody was wondering that. Both of them are same. The main difference being the squishiness of the sponge. Ultra safe, super squishy, the ultra black, medium squish is what we'll give it. Both of them do a great job releasing the dirt in a bucket, which we'll display here shortly. And besides the squish factor, the main difference is the price point. Ultra black comes in about $23 on the ragcompany.com. Ultra safe sponge is about 16. So you're gonna save a good chunk off the top by picking the ultra safe sponge. But will you get the longevity? That's gonna be a case we're gonna have to check it months to come. But let's see how they hold up with a first wash. Got a bunch of bugs on the Telluride. Uh, got some good traffic film down the side here. So let's give it the pre-rinse and then let's test out both sponges side by side. Kicking off the rinse wash process, we're using our detail keg to uh, knock off any loose debris, of course, with our pressurized rinseless wash. Using that Hero, you can see even here on this bird bomb that's been stuck on that glass, with the pressure and the power, uh, cleaning power of Hero, did a good job loosening it up, taking it off the surface. And here we go, ultra black sponge, of course, as, as uh, advertised, really nice sponge. And then we come in here with the USS, and this is where it shined on these big flat surfaces, super smooth, super slick, felt like a really ultra safe wash experience but where the ultra black sponge came back into prominent was right here, scrubbing them heavy bugs on the front off and uh, just one to two passes. 
and you can see it rinsed out with a, a rinse and wash solution really good. Now we pick up the Ultra Safe Sponge. This is where it struggled a bit. It took, uh, you know, three or four passes to get the same kind of bug contamination off the front. The Ultra Black Sponge knocked it off with one or two passes. On the traffic film side of things, same thing, where the Ultra Soft Sponge shined. Here was the door handle. You can get, on, get in there a little better and uh, hit that mirror with the UBS, knock them bugs off. And for the plastic trim, once again, UBS shined here with the extra scrubbing power. So there you go, quick comparison of the Ultra Safe Sponge and the Ultra Black Sponge. Both sponges did what they came to do, which was clean. In conjunction with our rinseless wash media, you can see we got quite the dirty bucket with all the bugs and traffic film we removed. But, but Hero looks like it's doing a great job of uh, you know pulling stuff to the bottom, keeping the water pretty clean up top. And both sponges paired with it did a phenomenal, phenomenal job. Now, pros and cons. Pros of the Ultra Safe Sponge is in conjunction with the super slick, really slick rinse and wash like Hero. It skated over the surface like ice, really, really smooth, really, really safe rinse and wash procedure, I would say, as the name suggests. Ultra Black Sponge, when it came to bugs, when it came, I think, to the lower parts with the plastic panel, you get kind of a better scrub with it, and it's gonna attack those bugs and heavier contaminants a little bit more aggressively. But at the same time with the with the laser cut grooves and the science of the rinseless wash and how it works, it is also a super safe process as well. So if you're like me, you got bugs on the front, you could dedicate the ultra black sponge to doing the front part or the lower parts of the vehicle and then switch to the ultra safe sponge to kind of do the flatter panels and the top of the vehicle. It's probably how I'm gonna continue to use these going forward. So both of them fit right in my arsenal pretty good. Both of them release dirt and material into uh, the rinseless wash bucket easily and safely. Both did an excellent job at that. So for me, both of them definitely fit in my arsenal. Get a slightly better scrub and agitation with this one. You get a slicker, safer wash experience with this one. The real deal would be seeing how this one holds up, you know, four to six months down the road. Of course, we won't go to test that right now, but I'm very interested to uh, a sponge so soft, how it holds up to where this ultra black sponge has been going strong six to 12 months at this point and zero problems so far. So price point wise, Ultra Safe Sponge takes the cake, especially when they have sales over at the Rag Company. If you want the safest wash experience possible, Ultra Safe Sponge takes the cake as well. Glides over the surface, especially when paired with a rinseless wash. Like today, we used Hero, super slick, kind of has a silica backbone, polymer, that kind of deal. So super slick with a sponge like this, designed for the safest rinseless wash procedure possible. If you're washing dirtier substrates like I did today with the bugs on the front, Traffic film and plastic panels on the bottom. The Ultra Black takes the cake. It's gonna give you a little bit better cleaning power, especially on that front to tackle the bugs. But both ultimately got the vehicle clean and did it in a very safe manner. Both sponges are definitely sticking around in my rinseless wash bucket in today's video. So go ahead and give me your thoughts in the comments which one you're gonna get for your rinseless washing needs. I'm sure if you already a rinseless washer, you've been had this one and you're looking to check out what's the deal with the Ultra Safe Sponge. Hopefully my feedback helped you out today when it comes to price, squish factor, and cleaning abilities. So that's all I got for this one, Ultra Black versus Ultra Safe. Both are staying in my bucket, both are great sponges, but pick which one fits your needs and head on over to the rag company and pick up either one. And on the 25th, pick you up some Hero. Smells great, performs great, super, super slick. Had some real good cleaning power to it. You saw it dissolve. The bird dropping on the windshield, you saw it do some work loosening up those bugs on the front. So good job, armor detail supply, very impressive, smells amazing, and uh, all that good stuff. We'll catch you on the next one. Like, subscribe, share, and that's all I got. So I noticed when drying with Hero Rinseless Wash, this is where it really shines, really slick, really nice experience under the drying towel for this step. So really good experience overall from Hero Rinseless Wash.